What is up guys, David Maximicic here. Today we are doing a blind test. We're going to compare Helix Native, XFX2 and the Kemper Profiler. And we're gonna compare same presets from my Little Cubes Volume 1 Impulse Response and Preset Library. I'm going to mark them as A, B and C. A could be either one of them, B could be either one of them, C could be either one of them. And you guys will let me know in the comments which one do you think is which by being like A is Kemper, B is XFX, C is Helix or maybe. Let's, let's dive into it. <laughs> Those are the three units. I'm gonna give you a couple of seconds to write your uh, results in the comments. 
while you're doing that, I'm going to tell you that my personal opinion, all three of them sound absolutely, absolutely awesome. They have different approaches to amp modeling and the guitar tone, but all of them, they sound great, both in the mix and isolated. They just sound great and feel absolutely amazing. I guess if you're thinking about getting one of those units, it really comes down to what do you need. Kemper is a pretty unique thing. It's profiling the amps with or without the cabinet. So what you get from the profile that you you know downloaded or bought or made yourself, it is what it is. Uh, there's not a lot of tweaking involved. Then Helix, they have their own approach to it. It's a lot more simplistic. They give you the amp models. They give you some cabs or an IR loader. So you can tweak them to some degree, but you can't really go crazy with it. And then XFX. XFX approaches things completely differently in a way. So you can take, for example, like a Marshall type amp like Plexi or GCM 800 and just modify it to your desire. You can make it sound completely different from the original amp and feel completely different. So um, price wise, they vary in price, of course. But yeah, I guess the main question is what are you able to afford, of course, and what do you actually need? If you need a kick ass guitar tone, all three of them will do. As for the results themselves, and yeah, I guess, I don't know. What do you think about these units, guys? What do you think about the results? Were the results surprising in any way? Did you, did you get it right? Uh, was it really easy to recognize which unit is which? Uh, let me know in the comments below. Um, we can start a really, really interesting discussion on this, on this subject. That's it for this video. Leave a like if you like the video. Uh, subscribe. Make sure to ring the bell because I don't really have a release schedule for the videos. So you make sure you get notified when I do release something. Um, and uh, yeah, I'll see you in the next video. Bye.